Hello, I'm Alan Turing. You might know me for machines, codes, or mathematics, but what truly drove me was curiosity and a deep desire to understand thought itself. I was born in London in 1912. Ever since I was a child, people called me odd, a dreamer, distant. But I wasn't distracted. I just thought differently. Logic fascinated me, the hidden order behind life's apparent chaos. I studied at Cambridge and later at Princeton. It was there I conceived an idea, a theoretical machine capable of performing any possible calculation. Today, they call it the Turing machine. But back then, it was simply my attempt to answer a fundamental question. Can machines think? During the Second World War, I was asked to help break the Enigma Code, the cipher used by the Nazis to protect their communications. Alongside a brilliant team, we built a machine capable of decoding thousands of messages a day. Thanks to that work, it's estimated we shortened the war by at least two years. No one knew that for decades. Ironically, although I helped save millions of lives, I was prosecuted for loving someone of the same sex. In 1952, I was convicted of indecency and forced to undergo chemical castration. I was cast out, humiliated. My crime was being who I was. The man died, yes, but the idea lived on. Today, every phone, every computer, every AI system holds at its core the principle of the universal machine I imagined. In a way, I'm still alive in every algorithm. I'm not a martyr or a hero. I was simply someone who thought differently. And if I can leave you with anything, it's this. Question everything. Love without fear. And never stop imagining.